Hey Star Wars fans, welcome to another Star Wars The Black Series 6 inch action figure review. Today we're looking at a Disney Parks exclusive. This is a pack that it's exclusive to Galaxy's Edge in uh, both Disneyland California and Disney World Florida. So I'm looking at Hondo Inaka. This is an absolutely awesome figure. Before we do it, we'll look at the box because um, this is some really nice packaging. Like I said, exclusive to the parks. They try and make it feel in universe as much as they can. They've obviously still got to abide by by warnings and English speaking language and stuff. Um, the basic languages, not as opposed to in universe languages. Um, but this set is called Smuggler's Run. It features Hondo Anaka, Ray. Uh, this is an updated version of the Jedi Ray from uh, The Last Jedi um, with photo real deco. I may get around to reviewing that at some point a repack of Chewbacca and a couple of new Porgs. So it's a really nice set. Great artwork on the front. Some cool features on the side of the box. Some text in Orabesh. We get another look at the back with a little bio on all of them. What I will read about Hondo, it says, Hondo Anaka is a weak way pirate turned legitimate businessman. Most would just call him a smuggler. A rough around the edges rogue. He would gladly sell his grandmother if there was money in it. <laughs> He is ostensibly on the side of the resistance, but he is also first and foremost on the side of Hondo Anaka. And uh, Hondo's a great, great character. So inside the box, you have the figures all laid out there. Another nice little write up here. It says scavengers, smugglers, and rebels meet at Batu, a remote outpost on the galaxy's edge. In a time where conflict spans the galaxy and allegiances are challenged, the lines between hero and villain become blurred. Everyone must find a way to survive, even if even if the means of survival require breaking some rules along the way. So this is a very nice pack. I'm um, really excited. I got this for my birthday a couple of weeks ago. And, uh, Hondo is one, one cool figure. Um, so I'm really, really excited to have this guy in my collection. I hope, I really hope he comes out it's part of the main line one day, but for the most part, I don't think he will anytime soon. Just a nice little reason to get over to Galaxy's Edge. Um, my wife actually got someone to pick these up in the US because um, we're not heading over there till next August. But look at that head sculpt, he's fantastic. He's such a cool looking character. The goggles aren't removable, but you can see his eyes underneath. His hat's not removable either, or helmet. Some great details though. His outfit, very similar to the one he wore in the Clone Wars. But this is uh, at a time quite some time after the Clone Wars. Um, we have seen his, seen his adventures in Star Wars Rebels. And this is set sort of 30 odd years later. So he's probably getting a little bit older. Um, I'm not sure what the lifespan of a weak way is. But he's very cool. Nicely detailed, nice colours. He's got his blaster, which is nice too. There's a slot there in his holster. I love that they've done this with this figure as well. It's the sort of duster coat that sort of wraps behind the holster so his blaster can be revealed. They did that with Tobias Beckett as well from Solo. That was, that was just a great, great looking feature to the figure. His boots. Just a really great looking guy. He's. He is really cool. <laughs> I dig Hondo. He's just a funny, funny and exciting, awesome character. Brought in through the Clone Wars. So articulation-wise, he has a ball-jointed head, ball-hinged neck, ball-hinged shoulders, ball-hinged elbows, ball-hinged wrists, uh, ball-joint in the torso, upper torso there, just at the, under the chest, ball-hinged hips, swivel thighs, double joints in the knees, and ball-hinged ankles, so... 
good articulation all the way through. And there we have Mr. Hondo Onaka. Very, very excited about this figure. It's fantastic. Definitely recommend trying to find a way to pick it up. Um, if you visit Galaxy's Edge, definitely don't hesitate. This is a this is a cool one to have. I'm beyond thrilled, like I've said a couple of times now. So until my next video, guys, thank you very much for watching. Let me know in the comments below what you think, and we'll see you on the next video. Until then, may the force be with you.